here? Nope. Hey guys, Canard Bastion here. This is my Pokemon Wilds file. Let's go see how to play this little game, shall we? And go. This is a fan-made game. It's pretty cool looking. Let's uh see how it goes. All right, I'm gonna pop that screen all the way up. Oh, I'm carrying a torch. Let's turn that down. Oh, oh you might join us, huh? Pick back. All right. Seems cheerful. Why not? Just caught ourselves a pick back, guys. All right. We don't need our mouse. Get rid of that. This is a nice little uh, house I made for myself here. So the Machop. He's the first one you start with. He, if you look at the, uh, so that sound means the uh, the overworld water is. I think they the tides are leaving or going away. Anyway, um, you got the Machop. He does a. Uh, he builds everything you got. The Bulbasaur does cuts. So took me a while to get him. Um, the cut cuts down everything you build. So if you put something in the wrong spot, you just use his cut to remove it. And you got uh, he, you can also use his cut to cut down all the trees and the grass, which is what you build most of your stuff out of. Uh, the Sandy Gas over here, he will let you dig. Uh, and we've got a ponytail, which you can ride. And he also illuminates things at night, so he keeps the ghosts away. Let's see what the pickpack does in a minute. But before that, maybe we wanted to show off all the Pokemon I had in my storage. We got a nice little Wingull. We got a Mary, Nazarel. We got five, count them, five eggs of Drowsy. We'll see what they hatch into it later. Nidoran. We got a little nice little Nidoran, level 14. A Combi and a Psyduck. A Psyduck that happens to be shiny. Uh, I got lucky with that one. All right, so that's all the Pokemon I got. I planted a couple of these trees here, as you can see. And uh, hopefully we can get some good apricorns here. But yeah, this is my nice little humble abode. That's what I started off with. Even has uh, three stories, believe it or not. Yeah, nothing up there yet, but we'll see. Uh, Alright, this is just kind of my little area. Well, let's go see what the map looks like. I have a map here. This is the area I've explored so far. There seems to be a very giant mountain in this area and off to the right we have some very nice we got a giant forest up top and a, and a very nice little beach area here we we'll definitely want to explore that too all right aside from that let's go see what we can what trouble we can get into eh? and to do that i'm going to bring up my ponyta i like all the sounds and stuff in the game but Hold X and really ride, and then ran right into a Pokemon encounter. Oh, Shinx! All right, hello, Shinx. Don't know if I capture him or not. I have one Pokeball, so we're gonna see if this works. Stomp him first. Sorry, little buddy. Ooh! If we do it again and get that same result, we can get it down to a hair thin of a red. Whoa, look at that. Ah, my guesstimation was correct, guys. Uh, Ponyta's defense fell. Alright, let's see if we can capture him. Last Pokeball. Let's try it. This don't work. I'm gonna have to smash him again. Oh, we caught him. Alright. Well, look at that. Alright, Ponyta, let's head on back. I'm gonna try to avoid the grass this time. You can run if you hold the X button down on your keyboard. This game is only for PC at the moment. I'm gonna go put him back up in my storage. Alright. Let's check his stats first. Tackle and Thundershock. Cute. Alright. Oh, it's getting dark, guys. Alright. I'll put the pickpack away, too. Just in case. Actually, let's see if he can fly before I do that. We're still getting used to controls here. Let's go with the pickpack. Nope, he can only follow. 
All right, you guess, I guess I got to evolve him for him to fly. We'll put him in storage, too. Thanks, Pickpack, for joining us. All right. Let's get my enter button. Pokemon. There we go, we got a pony. Let's ride him. And he even has his own little nightlight to ride with. What we got up here? All right, got some prison berries. There we go. Jabas. It's actually Jabba. All right. Okay, we gotta hold the X button. More prison berries. We're gonna find out what they can do here in a little bit. Alright. There's something up here. I'll switch to a different Pokemon. Machop. No. I meant Bulbasaur. Boom. Can't cut that, whatever that is. But we'll clear the land anyway, because why not? I don't want to kill a Pichu. I don't have any Pokeballs. I have to figure out how to make them. Sorry, Pichu. Ooh. Yep, so we're going to use Vine Whip and eliminate the problem. Not very effective, huh? This is my Bulbasaur's first battle. He's using Tail Whip. Alright guys, we're gonna switch to a different Pokemon because he is paralyzed and I don't <laughs> the game mechanics for fighting is exactly fleshed out in this game. I am no <laughs> I am no great Pokemon battler. But there we go. One hit KO. Very nice Machop. Bulbasaur is now level 2, guys. Look at that. Alright, so. The whole point of all that, anyway, was actually to clear out that whole section to see what that was. We got some grass, we got some logs, and more apricorns. Apricorns. I know you can make Pokeballs out of them, I just don't know how yet. We will get there. Oh! Another Pokemon! Oh, Pikachu! Mad because I killed his brother. Alright. Well, I'll have to give him the same treatment. And my chop is up, guys. It is level 19 versus level 9. That's kind of not fair. Sorry, Pikachu. Overall, it's a neat little game. You just sit here, go through, and...
Alright, hold X. Pokemon goes away. Now I can see what is this? Some weird dirt looking pile on. Oh. Oh, that's cute. I wonder if I can dig this up. Pokemon. Go to my gas. It's cute that you follow your Pokemon around and Soft sand. Okay. Weird. Interesting. Uh, you have to get it from the top or the bottom, apparently. You can't get it from the side. Alright. Anyway. So you sit there and you switch between C and V. Oh. Hold next to get out of here. We're going to get a new Pokemon up anyway. Go down to Ponyta. A Ponyta. All right. More prison berries. These might come in handy. Get my mic back. All right. Petcha berry. Now I'm going to actually use Bulbasaur here. Eliminate these trees right along here to make it easier to walk through without getting stuck. Because earlier there was a masquerade here that was in my way and he wasn't happy to pass. So now at least there's enough room for the both of us to walk if he comes back. Oh, it's a ghost! <laughs> that sound gets me every time, guys. I know you can get a slip scope to look at this ghost. I don't know if my paralyzed ghost star is going to work for me here. No! Poor Bulbasaur. Alright, so. Bulbasaur's down. Let's use our Machamp, Machop here to... Oh, let's use the Machamp. Machop. Let's go, buddy. Avenge. I don't know if this will work because it's a physical. It probably won't work. Yep, I didn't think so. Alright, guys. Last chance. Oh, we learned a hard lesson today, fellas. I'm gonna have to run. But it'll be awesome if my pony. T oh my goodness, I hit the, as the button too fast. We're gonna try to run, guys. We got out of there quick. Not before dying. I made these earlier while testing out the feature of digging. Alright. That means I can just as easily fill them back in if need be. Alright. Weird. I kind of like things to be certain. There we go. Much better. Doesn't it look a little better, ladies and gentlemen? Got a little island down here. I know there's a magic garb not too far. There he is. Maybe he's friendly and can join the party. Hold the X button. What's up, magic garb? Join us, buddy. We can get a Gyarados. That would be really cool. Welcome to the party, magic garb. Alright, before that, go Pokemon. 
check out what we got. He can only follow, and he's a level 10. All right. Let's go to our bubble star here. Let's cut. No, oh, no. I was hoping that Magic Garb could be able to like, swim or something, but that's yeah, fine. We're gonna clear off a little bit of the sound. No, quit, quit walking in the grass. Bulbasaur likes that grass. These are just some let's plays, that's how we're gonna do things. I figured that's what my channel's gonna be about. So, if you like, you know, watching this, and think you wanna see more, subscribe. I'm on BitChute. I'm on YouTube, I'm on Rumble, we're going to be in a different, you know, category across the board. Oh, we got some berries up here. Press the X button. Actually, you know what? Come back, folks, sorry. Alright. The controls are a little interesting, but I'm getting used to them. I mapped my button so it's WASD instead of the arrow keys, which does result in uh, the game thinking you're spelling when you try to rename a save file. So be aware of that before you do that. Alright. And this little grass. There we go. Got all the grass. Hold the X button. What we got here? More prison berries. Okay, cool. All right. All right. Oh, it's getting dark. Time to go. What we got here? Pokemon. Go all the way down on my ponyta. Ride. All right. Now, here, if you hold the X button while riding, you can practically fly across the land. Oh. Another Petra Bear. I guess those things have basically short respawn rates, which is pretty good. I think they respawn once in a day. I'm gonna come over here and put my magic carp up. And uh... No! See ya! And at that, we're gonna hit the item button and go to sleep. Oh, can't do that while riding. <laughs> oh, my bad. Test D. Sleep item. Sleeping bag. And use. Why sleep indoors when you can sleep outside with all your friends? Alright, we slept through the night. Let's check our Pokemon. And their health is going up slowly. That's what this does. It's kind of interesting to watch that number go up.
All right, here we go. He is so close. Oh, we're gonna get to level twenty. Poor Fampy. Fampy. All right, guys. Witness how cruel and mean. In reality, can be sometimes. Sorry, Fampy. Hit that twenty. Twenty-one. Blackjack. Oh, a couple more berries down here. Oh, what? We got eggs. We have more eggs. Let's see what made these. Yeah, he's aggressive. So is that one. But I don't know what made these eggs. <laughs> oh, they made it themselves. Okay, let's go. Run, run. And it's a milk tank. Hello. Hello, milk tank. Milk tank. How long were they? Oh, he made happiness. Goodness, okay. Well, we're gonna put the egg up. Find out what that is in a little bit. Now, I wonder if I go back out. Oh, he's still aggressive! Interesting. He's probably level 40. Oh, 33! Close enough. And the ball. We are going to... We can't run, so we're gonna have to fight him. Didn't mean to steal your kid, but I kind of did. Whoa! And I am dead. You might just wipe us out. Ooh, it is getting dark. It's getting dark in the game. I like that day day night cycle. It's really interesting. No! How dare you put sand on my sandy gas? That's <laughs> such a small attack. Alright, I just I can't do much else. Astonish. Doesn't do much either. I can't I'm not gonna sit there and do hard all the time. Thank you for giving Sandy Gas more sand. Absorbing, guys. We're gonna absorb this ambipom. Yeah, because she fell. Oh no! But how can you miss? You're made of sand. That's all he's giving you. More sand. We are just gonna keep missing, I guess. Oh, goodness.
No oh, goodness, we are almost there. All right, we are in the red. <laughs> it's been a, a seven-minute fight, guys, of me just smashing the Z button. So if you like this, smash the Z button and join me in Pokemon Wilds because the next update should have multiplayer. And if I'm still doing this by then, you're more than welcome to join me. And he's down. Wow, that took a whole solid, I think it's, that took me over five minutes. It, it absolutely took over five minutes. But I guarantee you it took near eight minutes of me just perpetually hitting the Z button. Let's just see how high this goes. Let's just see how high this goes. Mega Drain! That would have been helpful. <laughs> Eight levels! <laughs> Feels so bad. <laughs> oh no. Well, I guess that's all I'm gonna do for today, folks. Uh, this has been Canard Bastion, signing off. Don't forget to save. <laughs>